need some drinkware gift ideas? I have seven essentials for any occasion. Do you break into a sweat with even the thought of having company? I'm here to help. After trying just a few of my hosting tips, you'll be more than ready to say, come on over. So you're looking for drinkware to give as a gift. Let's start with a full set. Now, this is four. It could be four, six, eight, whatever comes in the box. And you can get these on Amazon, at TJ Maxx, really any store that carries kitchen items. These are a wonderful gift because they come in the box in case they need to be stored here, and it's a full set. Now, I do like more high-end giftware. So let's talk about what that is. You can look at the lip on here and see that it's a very fine lip. This is high end. These are generally a hand wash or if you have a light setting on your dishwasher that can work too. This is a red wine glass. But you can also get high end beer pilsners. I mean, aren't these cool? Has a nice base on it. Nice lip on that. I love my lip. You can get martini glasses, and these are kind of artsy, and we love to serve these sometimes because they tilt and people are like, and it's so fun. But high end, a little bit thicker of a lip on the martini glass, which is great if you want to sugar or salt the lip. And then we have bourbon glasses. The shape of it is what's important. I actually have two kind here. I have the regular bourbon glass Pretty fine lip on that. It's the bowl that makes it a bourbon glass. You slip me a bottle of bourbon, a little glass, and some ice. And this one is a Kentucky bourbon ale, which means it's a beer sitting in bourbon barrels. And it blends together, and so it has both a little bit of a bourbon flavor and the beer. And you can see by the shape of the glass why that works. And this is so fun to have these when we're actually serving Kentucky bourbon ale. So if your gift receiver is a big fan of that beer, there you go. Also, while we're talking about it, you can have any of these monogrammed. In fact, you can have almost anything on this bar here monogrammed, which is a nice little bonus for these kinds of gifts. Gift idea number two the rock glass. Now this is a very heavy glass and the reason is you're putting a lot of ice in here and if it's shooting out of your ice dispenser you don't want something fine like this that will crack and break. So these are heavy duty. You might just have shards of ice, you might have cubes of ice, you might have spheres of ice. But it goes down in here and then you pour your liquor over it and they're very substantial. You can also have these monogrammed and it's loads of fun to give away a monogrammed glass. Gift idea number three, that would be a wine carafe. And this is specifically for red wine. When you have a dark red wine and the darker, the more important this is, you want something that will help that wine breathe before you serve it. And so the carafe does that. You pour the entire bottle of wine into the carafe and then it breathes up the neck of the carafe. You can also monogram that. If you don't want to get into all of that, you can just buy a diffuser. It works similarly to this. It has a little filter in the top, little tiny filter, and you just place it over the glass and pour the wine through. It will kind of glug, glug, glug. Glug, glug, vroom, vroom. But it goes through the filter and through the whole system here and comes out and it aerates the wine to go into your glass. This is a wonderful gift idea for your serious red wine drinkers. Number four, a wine bottle coaster, or as they called them in the 40s and 50s, ashtray. Oh, we burn for cigarettes. <laughs> yes, this is an ashtray. There's actually a little slot right here, but you know what they're also great for? Catching spills. If you have a red wine on your table and a tablecloth, chances are pretty good that whoever is pouring is going to have some of that wine dribble down the side of your bottle and onto your tablecloth. So why don't we just put it in the coaster and take care of that problem before it even happens. Number five, champagne bucket. 
Now, this is not a fancy champagne bucket. I know it looks maybe like a little fancy, got the little handles here, but it's a very lightweight bucket and it doesn't have to be in great shape. You're, you're as healthy as a horse. Yeah, Clydesdale. The whole idea behind the champagne bucket is that it has ice in here and you put the champagne down in there and it chills it for you and keeps it chilled as you use the champagne. People don't tend to gulp champagne, they tend to sip it, which is how you want it to be consumed. So a champagne bottle fits down in here nicely and guess what you can do to this bucket? Monogram. Enough already! Gift idea number six. This one's really kind of cool. You can get kits that are what's called flights. So this one has a bourbon flight on it. There's six little tiny glasses. And so what you're doing is you're trying out different kinds of bourbon. You can get them for beer, for wine. It's wonderful to have it on hand if you're into doing parties where you're pairing or you're trying different vintages or trying different brands, but you just maybe want a little bit. I love Jesus, but I drink a little. <laughs> So you get the benefit of trying out somebody else's favorite wine or bourbon or beer, but maybe just a little bit. You might not love it, but you're willing to try it and you use a flight to do that. And number seven, not actually glassware, but it is drinkware because it helps you serve what you're offering. So just a really nice, heavy, old fashioned wine bottle opener, or maybe a funky iron beer bottle opener. You can also help with corks. This is a nice heavy cork with a seal, a rubber seal around it into the bottle of wine when you're gonna save it for the next day. You also can get kits that have the opener and the foil cutter inside. So if you look at this bottle over here, it has a seal on it. This goes around it, you spin it, it cuts that seal off to help you get into the cork easier. And then you can just do fun things. I mean, who wouldn't want a mustache opener, huh? Who? Nobody I know. Fake mustache isn't gonna cut it. Or if you're into mixed drinks, you can use this little doohickey, which you place right over the glass, and then you can squeeze your lemon or your lime or filter things through here. Wonderful for that. So, many ideas to make the gift unique and classy. Don't forget to monogram. Stop it. Get some help. But most importantly, get the best or most high end that you can afford. Because when it comes to things like this, quality matters. I have seven essentials for any occasion. No, that's not what I meant. Yes, it was. I did it right the first time. <laughs> any store that serves the entire set. They don't serve it. They sell it. Let's not do that. I feel like Vanna White. And having just the right... <laughs> really? Or if you like to make minx... Minx? They're minx. not minx. Good grief. Come on over. Now go make someone feel special today.